What if you stopped sleeping? Sleep is something we all do. Sometimes we feel we don't get enough of it. Some have too much of it. But imagine for a minute how much you could get done if you didn't sleep at all. With all that extra time, you could turn into a superhuman, or that's what you would like to think. Does hallucinating or having delusions that make you feel like you're part of a real-life horror movie sound fun? This is something that can actually happen to you with lack of sleep. The longest recorded time without sleep is approximately 264 hours, or just over 11 consecutive days. Although it's unclear exactly how long humans can survive without sleep, it isn't long before the effects of sleep deprivation start to show. In this video, we're going to look at different stages of the effects on your body the longer you go without sleep. Before we look at this, a quick reminder to give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying it, and also to subscribe to Brain Impact for more videos just like this one. But now, back to sleep. Sleep deprivation occurs when a person gets less sleep than their body needs. The effects of sleep deprivation can vary from person to person. Children and teenagers need more sleep than adults as their brains and bodies are still developing and growing. This means the effect of sleep deprivation in children can sometimes be more severe or longer lasting. Many of us have missed a night's sleep, maybe to catch up on work, study for an exam, or look after a sick child. This in itself will not cause a significant impact on your overall health, but it will affect you. After missing just one night of sleep, you will definitely feel drowsy and on top of that, your body starts to produce an excessive amount of the hormone cortisol. Excessive cortisol would make you irritable and anxious which leads to tension and confusion, impaired decision making, altered perception, memory deficits, vision and hearing impairments, decreased hand-eye coordination, tremors, and increased risk of accidents or near misses. Studies have compared this to having a blood alcohol concentration of 0.10%. This is above the legal limit in most countries. Your sleep-wake cycle is what helps regulate the release of certain hormones, including insulin and human growth hormone. This can mean going without sleep for a longer period of time can alter a lot of your bodily functions, including your appetite, metabolism, temperature, mood, and stress level. So, after 36 hours without sleep, your body will be suffering from extreme fatigue, hormone imbalances, decreased motivation, risky decision-making, inflexible reasoning, decreased attention, and speech impairments such as poor word choice. The effects of sleep deprivation intensify the longer a person stays awake. If you do manage to stay awake for 48 hours, which is very difficult for most people to do, things will start to get a bit terrifying as this is when the hallucinating will start. A lack of vital chemicals and nutrients triggers reactions in your overstimulated brain, causing delusions. You may see and hear things that aren't actually real, like whispers, strange sounds, and visions. You may also start losing track of time and forget basic things like your name or how to eat. At this point, your brain will start entering brief periods of complete unconsciousness, also known as microsleep. Microsleep occurs involuntarily and can last for several seconds. This is also the point when your body would struggle to fight off viruses and bacteria due to the disruption of your immune system. After 72 hours without sleep, you'll probably experience an overwhelming urge to sleep. It's unlikely that you'll be able to stay awake without the aid of a huge amount of caffeine. But if you do manage to stay awake, this is the time all of your emotions will be affected. Paranoia will set in, along with depression. It's unlikely that you'd be able to complete any tasks and you'd find it difficult to recognize angry or happy facial expressions. Lack of sleep also tends to increase your appetite for junk food and plenty of it, which then leads to weight gain and a very high risk of diabetes or heart disease. And eating empty calories can ultimately leave you more tired. Although all of these effects on your body sound horrendous, they do resolve themselves once you get enough sleep. But if you suffer with chronic partial sleep deprivation, which is when you don't get enough sleep on a regular basis, it's a different story, as this can cause cardiovascular diseases, obesity, diabetes, and mental illness. Almost nobody in sound mind has managed to cross the line of staying awake past 11 days. The only official record belongs to Randy Gardner, a 17-year-old student from San Diego who conducted an experiment for a scientific project in 1964. It's not clear how long a person can go without sleep continuously, but we think it's safe to say that it may not be a lack of sleep that could cause death, but the effects that it has on your body could quite easily cause accidents that in turn could result in death. 
How long do you think you could stay awake? Or is sleep just too important to you that you wouldn't even try? Let us know in the comments and please like this video if you've enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos like this one, then subscribe to Brain Impact for more. Thanks for watching.